just like wow. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, I am going to be using avocado. I'm going to mix this avocado with other natural ingredients to create a powerful facial mask. This facial mask is loaded with antioxidant. Antioxidants such as vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin D, and even vitamin E. Now what this is going to do for your skin once you use it on the regular at least three times per week, it's going to take your skin to the next level. It's going to get rid of the hyperpigmentation on your skin. It's going to help to lift and firm and tighten your skin. It's also going to have your skin just hydrated, soft and supple. And best of all, it's going to help to get rid of the wrinkles on fine lines. So if you're looking for that natural homemade facial mask, that's going to do all of that. Come with me to the kitchen and I'll share the recipe with you. And I will also show you how to apply it to your skin for best result. Now let's take a look at our main ingredient, which is avocado. Now avocado is rich in fatty acid and it is an excellent moisturizer for the skin. In addition, it contains vitamin E. Avocado also contains potassium and many other nutrients that can nourish and moisturize the skin. It helps to soften the skin and most of all, it helps to reduce the sign of aging. Now the first thing we're gonna do with our avocado, we're gonna use a about a ounce or two of the avocado and we are gonna blend we're just gonna peel remove the outer peel and we're just gonna chop place it in the blender and now we are gonna blend do not add any water to this just blend as is Take a look at this. This is the blended avocado. Just pour this in. Now this is it. Now the avocado is gonna get dark, so you can always choose to keep it really nice and bright by taking a little bit of a lemon zest or orange zest or even some lemon juice so i'm just gonna add a little bit of an orange peel powder to this and i'm gonna blend it in and this is gonna help to brighten the skin but it's also gonna help to keep the avocado from getting dark okay the oil from the orange peel is great for the skin so a win-win right here now take a look at our next ingredient and this is oatmeal and look at this oatmeal up close Oatmeal has rich antioxidant properties and it helps undo damage done to your skin by pollution and also sun damage, UV ray. Oatmeal helps reduce itching and inflammation and can be used to calm eczema. It also contains tightening properties that will help to tighten and firm the skin. Oil absorbing properties for those of you with oily skin. It also have to get rid of dead skin cells from the surface of the skin. So a wonderful ingredient to use in this recipe. Now to prepare this oatmeal, what you're going to do, you are going to blend the oatmeal to a powder. And here I already have some blended oatmeal and this is what it looks like. Our next ingredient is aloe vera gel. And we're going to be using about two ounces of fresh aloe vera gel. So I'm just going to cut a piece like this. Here it is. Now take a look at this. This is the gel. And to get the gel, you got to remove the outer peel. So to remove the outer peel, you can just simply peel it off. But I like to just cut the side and work my knife right under it. Still a way of peeling it. So peel off the upper layer like this now if you do not have a blender at this stage you can go ahead and scrape the gel off there you have fresh gel if you have a blender just peel the other side off spill it off just like that and this is it here you have the fresh aloe vera gel and next what we're gonna do with this I'm gonna blend do not add any water to this just blend as is and here we have it, a fresh aloe vera gel. 
and this is how you know that it is fresh once it is as frothy as this is that's a sign that the aloe vera gel is fresh putting that aside and we are moving on now moving on to the next ingredient if you have oily skin you can choose to use a little bit of a grapeseed oil in this recipe if you have a dry skin you can choose to use some coconut oil or even some olive oil you can also choose to use a little bit of a honey today I'm gonna to be using a little bit of a grapeseed oil and a little bit of a honey in this recipe now our final ingredient for this recipe is some milk and milk contains vitamin A and and vitamin D a wonderful ingredient to fight the sign of aging reduce wrinkles and fine lines and also it contain lactic acid it will help to brighten that skin and leave your skin just moisturized now to make this mask I'm gonna be using the blender since I'm gonna be blending back everything together so the first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna reach for our avocado and remember I had a little bit of a dried orange peel powder to this so I'm gonna be using a 1 8 of a cup 30 ml of the avocado mix pour this in the cup now reaching for the oatmeal I'm gonna be using one tablespoon of the blended oatmeal which is 15 ml I'm pouring this in the blender now I'm reaching for the aloe vera gel and I'm gonna use one tablespoon of the aloe vera gel 15 ml we're pouring this in now when it comes on to our grapeseed oil I'm gonna use a half of a teaspoon 2.5 ml if you are using any other oil use the same amount just a half of a teaspoon you really do not need a lot I'll pour this in and if you're going to be using the honey I'm going to be using the honey and I'm using the same amount a half of a teaspoon 2.5 ml pour this in and next we're moving on to our milk and I'm using a half of a teaspoon 7.5 ml of the milk fresh milk if you are vegan you can leave the milk out or you can use a little bit of a almond milk and now we are going to close this up and we are going to blend now we're going to check this to make sure it's okay if it is too let's see and this is perfect we do not need to add any more liquid to this so this is good and let's just pour this out in whatever container you're going to stir it in nice and creamy face mask and here you have it your avocado anti-aging skin tightening wrinkle fighting facial mask now guys as this facial mask I suggest you place it in the refrigerator for about an hour before you use it and then you are good to go you can store it in your refrigerator I suggest you store it for about three to four days the longest since we have some milk in it you don't want to keep it too long fresh is always better okay so store it for no more than about four days in the refrigerator however before you use it for the first time just place it in your refrigerator for about an hour and now, now take a look this is the facial mask now before you use it you want to make sure to give it a little stir just stir it up and this is very cold guys and this is exactly how you want it to be now I'm gonna use my hands to apply this to my face you can go ahead and you can choose to use a brush to apply it before you apply this homemade facial mask you want to apply it to clean skin therefore wash your face exfoliate your face pat dry the skin and now you are ready for the facial mask now you want to be generous with this facial mask okay and remember because you put it in the refrigerator it's going to be very cold so be prepared so i'm going to take about this amount and this is really cold this is like a no joke okay and are you ready for this I'm just going to apply it to my face Whoa, whoa so cold ready ready ready, ready. Mm -hmm. yep it's amazing oh goodness this is nice mm -hmm. cold and nice upper lips forehead I like a mask that you can apply with your hands 
because you tend to give it a little exfoliating action before, like this one. So just apply the mask all over your face. It feels really, really good. Be generous with it. Cover your nose, under your eyes. Oh, amazing, refreshing. I'm just like breathing just now, like. And this is exactly what you want your facial mask to do for you. You want when you apply it, it's so relaxing that you just like. Wow. All right, so. Now, after applying the mask to your skin, you're going to sit with this for at least 30 minutes. This is feeling so awesome on my skin right now. Like, really and truly amazing. Oh, so nice. Oh, oh, really and truly amazing. Really and truly amazing. So when you put a facial mask on and it's really good you could actually feel it you see i just take a deep breather just now and now i just feel like dancing 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 that's how good this is feeling right now and that's what you want you want your facial mask not only to take care of your skin but to put you in a really good mood and i'm loving this one right now okay guys so after applying the mask and after doing your little dance, you're gonna sit with this for 30 minutes. Now you could also continue to dance with your mask on for 30 minutes. You're gonna reap a lot of benefit if you have things to it like, ah, oh, you're working out, yeah. All right, I'm just having too much fun. So after 30 minutes, you're gonna rinse this off, preferably with some room temperature water, and then you're gonna pat dry the skin. Apply your favorite facial toner, your favorite facial serum, and your favorite oil or moisturizer. Go ahead, give this awesome goodness a try. Remember, it's always good to come back and leave a comment after you try the facial mask, okay? So there you have it. What can I say? An amazing facial mask. But don't take my word for it. Give it a try for yourself. Use it for a week and then come back and leave a comment. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Oh, if this was the first time watching and you have not yet subscribed, don't leave without subscribing because I'm sure you want to see more of these amazing videos. So look below, you're going to see the word subscribe. Just click on it and you will be subscribed. Thank you all and I'll see you in my next video. Mm -hmm.